playing football probably means means a, a really lot to me because uh, it's something that I can do that can sort of um, make my family proud of me. Um, you know, all my family always checking for my games, watching the games from from back home in New Zealand and uh, in Greece as well. So it's something that um, that gives me a connection to my family in a sense as well, and um, it's something that I really look forward to talking to them about. Uh, playing football is, well it has become sort of my whole life and has been since I was probably six. Um, it's, I'm lucky enough to have got to the point where it's become my job um, and to be able to go to work every single day and absolutely adore your job and do it with your best friends and travel the world and represent your country, it's just, it's unbelievable and it's hard to put into words how happy I am with how life sort of unfolded and that I, I get to do it uh, professionally and play overseas and yeah, so uh, I mean from a young age it's, it, it's always been just fun and I've never had to think about it and drag myself out of bed every morning to go to training, it's just what I want to be doing so it's pretty awesome. I think obviously just uh, expressing myself on the field there. Um, and the connections that you make while you're playing football as well. I've met some great people playing football um, and it's just you know something that I've loved for such a long time so it's a, it's a, it's a blessing to be able to do that um, as a job. I mean as I said before traveling the world uh, with my best friends and seeing different countries and playing against different countries and representing uh, Australia on a, on a regular basis is pretty awesome. My dad was a massive uh, football fan, uh, he used to play at a decent level in Greece as well uh, and I've got an older brother who's two years older than me so pretty much when I was born there was already a ball in my face so uh, I didn't really have a choice and uh, I didn't need a choice as, soon, as far as I can remember I loved it so uh, I remember playing um, inside uh, with our socks uh, until our socks had holes in them so it's um, just something that's been instilled in me since I can remember. I went through a lot of different sports when I was really little. My brother and a few of the boys from around the neighbourhood used to play every sport under the sun and I even went through a path where I did ballet and I'm not sure how I ended up there and it didn't last very long. Um, but once I sort of, uh, my brother played soccer and he and a few of the boys at the club uh, would involve me and I'd sort of run up and down the sideline and show up in front of the parents and Eventually they said just throw her in, so when I was around six I, I started playing at um, East Bentley Junior Soccer Club and uh, haven't stopped since. I think, like I said before, uh, just the, the friends that I've made here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have friends for the rest of my life from, from football. Um, the enjoyment of you know getting onto the field and um, you know knowing there's people, thousands of people there watching to see how you perform, and I think that's just you know an amazing thing, and it brings people together. Um, and um, yeah, just to, just to be able to do what I love every day. There's a there's a lot of benefits, but one of the ones that I found really rewarding was just. I, I gained a lot of skills like leadership and how to work in a team and stuff like that from a young age and um, it sort of helps you think about others and, and things that maybe you wouldn't understand when you're pretty young so um, that and it's just fun. <laughs> You know, club-wise, just to, to play at a, as high a level as I can personally. Um, you know, I've had great success here while I've been here at uh, the Victory. Um, and pretty much, you know, since I've been in the A-League, I've, I've been lucky enough to enjoy success. Um, so just to keep pushing myself and obviously with the New Zealand national team to, to hopefully try to get to a World Cup. I mean, it was up until this year to play in a World Cup. Um, but sort of understanding how good our national team can be and how young we are and the fact that we'll be at sort of prime condition um, by the time we get to France would be to medal at a World Cup. I think that would just be incredible. I guess probably playing in the uh, London Olympics in 2012 would be up there, uh, playing at Old Trafford, um, packed stadium against Egypt. 
that was fantastic and then we played against Brazil at St James's Park so both amazing memories and uh, I'd have to say the grand final here as well last, uh, last season was pretty cool too. The moments leading up to my first World Cup game, it was sort of surreal because it's something that I've dreamed about for so long and um, I literally put in every single moment for so long up until to get that reward. So to, and especially against, to, to be playing against the US um, in front of a sold out crowd, it was, it was pretty insane and it was exciting and uh, definitely something I'll never forget.